What's going on guys? My name is Rindik and you're watching Calcutech. Today we're gonna review the Redmi 5 Plus on Mi 12. So without going further ahead, let's start the video. Come on. Hey, the Mi 12 has launched uh, for Redmi devices uh, like beta. So uh, I booted, the, uh, booted up the device. Mm. Actually, Mi 12 is, oh yeah, we finally said goodbye to a uh, good old Mi 11, but uh, you will like the Mi 12 when you see it. And there will be a comeback soon with uh, the Redmi 7 on Mi 11. Uh, which do you prefer, Mi 11 or Mi 12? Type it in the comments. Okay, it's booting up. Oh, uh, the Mi logo doesn't pop up, but instead the Redmi logo. Yeah, this is the uh, ROM for like K20 Pro. So, yeah. Uh, it's like so laggy. It's like, that's the number one bug. Even uh, the brightness slider doesn't work. Yeah, and the hotspot. But there's a fix for that in the uh, description section below. So, wow, this is so cool, yeah, like MIUI version and storage. Uh, if you want to install this ROM, we made this ROM. Uh, it's in the description. It's free for you. Just download it in the description. Okay, as you can see, Android version, it's Android 10. So cool, yeah, but the, uh, you know, that bar doesn't come, like, you know, the full screen gesture for Android 10, that doesn't come with this. Uh, that's also a bug. The recent apps is like so cool. We can switch between apps. Oh yeah, this is the number one thing. The control center. Look. This is just like iOS, okay? I'm not kidding. It's just like iOS. The control center and the notification center. Look. The difference between Mi 11 and 12. Yeah, I think Xiaomi... I know what to say. You, this is a notification bar, just like I use. I don't know why, man. I didn't know that Xiaomi do this stuff, but still cool, okay? Just like, you know, I use. Yeah, uh, even the animations have been, you know, like, uh, have been like smooth. There's also one more bug, there's no camera app for this device, like no camera app. Uh, even no play store. Then, uh, look, sound and vibration all the same. Then what to show, password and security changed a lot, like really a lot, okay. Then uh, my device. Now your uh, new version, the uh, 12 logo has been like, it isn't like what we expected but I really like this logo. Um, can't connect to network, I don't know why. Uh, but network works, yeah. So uh, let's go to additional settings, uh, full screen display, even we get the old buttons. Uh, like just the same but we don't get that pill on android 10 and iphone i don't know why i think that's a bug i don't know how to fix it but it'll be fixed in the room so the storage has been realigned it's like you know a pill with lots of colors it's like awesome okay um, even there's a fluid animation for that uh, oh it's so laggy okay and um oh sorry uh, the apple does not work i mean when i go through it it's like full back the lock screen has been redesigned full and the unlock animation has been like yeah little different like it's zooming in and out and um there's no always on display for this room i don't know why and uh, the wallpaper only the marks like thing wallpaper only one i don't know why but and that's the main word people forget. Even there are two themes like me 11, 10, everything. Classical and limitless. I don't know why Xiaomi is not changing this. And I got angry when I heard this. The icon pad did not change. Yeah. Uh, that's such a hard break. Yeah. Uh, oh. You should install it. Yeah. It's in the description. This room. The control center, I, it's like really cool. Oh, sorry, I got a mark in that. Okay, even VOLTE works. 
in this. Sorry, my display is a little burned up. Uh, I don't know why. Sorry. Mm. Then um, I don't see any bugs at all. But this is just for like reviewing. Okay, don't. Uh, yeah. <coughs> Uh, and uh, I gotta say this, okay? Xiaomi also copied one UI, Samsung's one UI. Because look, uh, did you see that settings lock screen look? Uh, you know, Xiaomi has made an interaction area and viewing area just like Samsung. Uh, above settings, there's an interaction area like settings and viewing area. Uh, if you don't know what that is, just uh, look Samsung's One UI trailer. Okay, that's also in the description. Okay, so uh, it's the end of the video. Now I'm gonna show you how to, you know, uh, flash this ROM. So first you gotta power off your device, then uh, click the volume up button and the power button on your uh, redmi device then after that uh, uh, you gotta like press it for five seconds or something or more than that then uh, it's gonna pop at a recovery and then um, wait for some time actually like uh, you know uh, 10 or 15 seconds okay i think it's uh, gone to the recovery so now you gotta go to wipe then you gotta tick some things like uh, you gotta tick Dalvik system data cache vendor. Then uh, what you need to do is just swipe to wipe. You gotta swipe, but I'm not swiping because you know. Um, then you should go to files. Then go to that file uh, named uh, me. Sorry, then you gotta go to file name v me y 12 wins 3. That's our room. You gotta click that. You gotta long press it, okay? Not click. Long press it. Oh, sorry. Long press, okay? I tapped it. You, you should long press it. Then you should uh, click open as. Then you just... No, no, no. Sorry. Uh, you gotta take back. Then, uh, yeah, open as. Then um, back up. Then swipe. Just that it's a little hard, yeah. I know because you know it's beta. Um, then you gotta go to menu, uh, menu, reboot, and click system. That's all. Like this video, subscribe, and comment. See you in the next video.